Tell me, do you believe in magic? <laughs> you must if you've sought me out. Have a seat, won't you? I'm afraid that I don't have anything to serve you. It's been quite a while since I've had visitors. I do my best to keep away from others, after all. Who believes in magicians nowadays, anyway? Right? Even so, you are here. Here you are. In my study. I don't make things easy for people to get here. So, how did you get past my defenses? There were none. Hmm. Interesting. No, that's a subject for a different time. I suppose it just means you've come in peace, so to speak. You still haven't answered my question. Do you believe in magic? A skeptic? Good. I love skeptics. Oh yeah, there's so much more entertaining than believers. There's always some level of disbelief there. I love to make it disappear. Sorry, magic joke. Afraid my sense of humor is the one thing I can't change... magically. It's a little dark in here. Forgive me. Not impressed? Well, I always did love a challenge. Ah, uh, apologies. You're shivering as well. Hard as stone, aren't you? Fine. Enough showmanship for now. What can this humble magician do for you? You must have sought me out for a reason. Why else would you find yourself here? This study exists everywhere, and... Nowhere, at once. Sometimes I place it. Sometimes it seeks out those who need me. Since I've never seen you, I'm assuming it's the latter. Fascinating. I think this is the first time I've been summoned to a university before. Bit cliche. You open the door to your library and end up here. So, a lucky stranger. I wonder what sort of magic you might need. Magic is very much real. As real as you and I. Without magic, the world would be a very boring place. Don't you think? If you've never seen it before, perhaps you haven't been looking hard enough? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I suppose I'm a little rude. Pick a card. Oh, come on. Pick a card. What have you got to lose? Great. Look at it. Don't let me see it. Now, put it in the deck. What? Ever seen cards shuffle themselves before? Ah, uh, this one. Queen of Hearts. A fitting card for such a... beautiful stranger. 
It is your card. My magic never fails. Impressed now? Sure, you can check for wires all you'd like. There are none. A dream? Hmm. Perhaps. We are such stuff as dreams are made on. And our little life is rounded with a sleep. Shakespeare wrote that. Betty believed in magic. Anyways, maybe this whole place is a dream. Maybe I'm not really here. But you seem fairly intelligent. Do you think that's the case? As I said, the study sent you to me. You need my help. My magic, to be more precise. You're an odd one. Usually when someone is told that their biggest problems can be solved with magic, they're a little more... grateful. <sighs> you still don't believe it. That's fine. I suppose that puts us in an impasse. See, my magic won't work if you don't believe in it. Magic is a cast by those who believe. It can only help those who believe. The fact that you ended up here means that somewhere deep down, part of you believes. But there's only so much I can do to prove it to you. It's a leap of faith. The door is right over there. You're welcome to go back to where you came from. No. Mistakes don't happen. If you're here, it isn't by mere chance. It was destined. Faded, so to speak. Shall I show you another trick? This one will be good. I promise. I'm gonna put my cape over us, and when I say the magic word... Abracadabra! See? I made the study disappear. Or, more accurately, I made us disappear. You like the ocean. Call it... Intuition. You seem like the type who used to run too deep into the waves when you were little. Am I right? <laughs> keep your secrets then. And I'll keep mine. I told you. You need me. Why? Who knows? But you came to me. That's not mere chance. You need my magic. A spell. Something that only I can do. Is that what you wish for? Riches beyond your wildest dreams? Money won't make you happy. It would solve some problems, yeah, but it's never enough. You'll always want more. Perhaps the study brought you to me to help you figure it out. Of course you have an option. Always. You're more than welcome to go back to where you came from. Back to your whatever dull life you've had. Ignore the gift that's been given to you. Or you could accept. Experience something so many only dream of. All you have to do is answer one simple question. Do you believe in magic? Good. 
I look forward to working with you. Apologies. It seems I've kept you too long. I'll be in touch.